Yeah, I definitely know how these characters do. Yeah. I definitely know how to play this game. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, DDD? Alright. So basically, I'm expecting the DDD to not do woodies. Um, so. Just kind of going at each other. Yeah, I'm seeing a lot of. I need to stop That's the first stop. I'm kind of expecting the yellow team to have to approach more based on the fact that we lose DDD and Lucas. Both yeah. characters have yeah. either projectiles yeah. or really big normals. Yep. He's fine though. He's DDD. He's gonna live for a little bit longer. Oh. Oh yeah. No. Never mind. Blazing end just killed really early. Not blazing end. Uh. What is it called? The Uppy. Prominence revolt. Blazing end's the side move. That move doesn't kill. F tilt. Um. It's 3-1. Both teams are even on stocks right now. Although Pyra is only on one stock. Well, the scene is on three. And Lucina loses a stock. So blue team's up by one. Can Chris. Oh! TK freezes his own teammate. <laughs> Off stage. Oh. So, um, the blue team is up by an entire two stocks, and we're down to one v two. Should be the game is pretty much over. Unless, unless Dave can make the comeback. Oh, <laughs> oh man, a back air spike. That was nice. Now that we don't have it, I kind of miss the Among Us. Yeah, the Among Us. <laughs> Among Us. <laughs> R.I.P. Dozer okay, Dave. You never know what you have until it's gone. You know? Yeah. Whenever one would disrespect me, we'll bring it back. <laughs> The disrespect just among us. Among us! That was the best clip to I come out no of last idea. year. Kevin. Kevin. Uh it's two, it's two bands, I'm pretty sure. Two bands. Are we going on stream after? Or are we I just taking the first set? Smash. set I can't wait. And I'm commentating. I mean, I know about Smash. It's just that doubles is really hard to. I know about Smash. I, it's just. I, play Pokemon Trader. I know about Smash. It's just that doubles is very hard to follow for me because there's just so much going on. You're right. Somebody should call me. Oh, yeah. If you want to, please take it. We gotta play anyway, so. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, Matt, are we up? Uh, on stream will always be the front computer. Yeah, computer. Which we'll see over there also. Great. Uh, right. Okay, yeah, what? Yeah, I'll try to do uh, I don't know when our next match is, so. I was gonna say, um, it sounds like whenever I get these, like, if I'm home, I'm gonna have to go through a combo. Don't try to say, just be the guy with me, because I just don't know how to do it. Okay, so now we're on. Oh, well, this is Alter Beast. I am not a Villanova student. I am from TCJ, and we are on with doubles winners round one. We have Michael and Dave versus Cam and Chris. 
Do they have a special name or any teams have a special name? Do, do any of these teams have like a specific name? Like, was one of the teams named Squidward or the Kane's Oh, no, one of them was the Kane's crew. Yeah, Kane's crew. 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 Yeah. The other one, I'm not sure what the team is. Anyway, back to our match. We see... We we see Michael and Dave here are playing the Sardi, so therefore they're, they're one thing that's very important to them is that they get that stage control. Doubles is no easy no easy game to play, you know. You, you gotta understand how to control that stage, how to take that advantage. I mean, I love doubles, it's just I stink at it, but you know. Oh, the cloud uses his limit. It, it's just a lot going on right now. Um, we, yeah, yeah, we try to see the sorties try to get Lucas and DDD off stage because they're rec I mean, Lucas is a recovery you can mix up, but DDD's recovery is kind of exploitable. Rory's recovery, though, is actually very versatile when you think about it. Cloud is the limit again. You see down there, DDD summon his annoying Gordos. Using PK threes. Uh, we see both Cam and Chris are on their last stocks. Up oh, and Dave's out, but will but will Michael give Dave his last stock? Will there be a trade off? Oh, hi. Sorry, my commentary sucks. I'm no, no, you're better than us. We were just not saying anything. <laughs> So as you can um, see, for someone like Cloud, what? I was trying to commentate. Oh, I know it's the same thing. It's it's on like all all of these. I know. Yeah. So you see here that Cloud, he, he's just trying to live, you know. And I feel like it's all. But some but sometimes you know I notice that Luke I. I see Cam's trying to snowball here with the PK freeze. I mean, literally, because it's literally made out of ice. But ah, uh, and he misses the finishing touch. Sheesh! But isn't that going to cost Michael and Dave the first game? Chris, however, is trying to edge guard him with the edge guard. Oh, I see what he's trying to do. I see you. I see you. Oh! oh, oh that forward smash! That is the plot armor right there. Unexpected. That was the plot armor, and the, the yellow team, Michael and Dave, take the take game one. Game, that was game two. Oh, this is game two. Yeah, I might have hopped in mid set. I think we can edit it. Yeah, so I got an idea. Yeah, um, Alright, so we're gonna see they're sticking with the same characters. I think it is. I don't see that the, the overlays changed this yet. 
versus game three. They're one to one right now. Uh, so it's tied. Oh. Uh -huh. This is the deciding game. But right now we see Cam and Chris are in the lead. I feel like with DDD, I feel like the sorties can definitely combo him because of their lightweights and their and their aerials and tilts are able to really put DDD in that zone. But oh, Michael with a nice, deep, nasty spike against Cam. These players are trying to sauce him out from here, but we'll see what they can do. Oh, and that cross slash. Oh, and that limit. The limit side special. Excellent stuff for Michael. But care. Oh, the footstool by Dave. Very smart. But the problem with DDD is that he's so big. I feel like. hits on him. I'm sorry that I can't drop you here, but I'm. Um, I feel like with any heavy in this game, you're you're about to get bodied, and I feel that's the problem with all heavies in any yeah. fighting game. You just gotta watch to get bodied because they don't, you know, they're, they're if they're very exploitable, dude. They're very big uh, hurt boxes in fighting games. I mean, it makes sense. He's the heavy hitter, and they definitely work with them. I mean, you could blame Street Fighter when Zangief was broken, but um, and that's what caused heavies to pretty much suck in most fighting games. But we, I mean, Bowser's really good at Kazuya too. But uh, everyone's left at one stock. It's, yeah, it's very it's close. Very, very oh, Lucas with the dunk, but but didn't quite they didn't quite do it. They need to get some damage on Dave. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, and oh. Michael is out with the DDD up smash from Chris. That's really good for them. But it looks like it's two on one here. Can can Roy, the boy, do this? Chris is one good hit away. Yeah, just one little one smash attack, and he's pretty much done for. And, or even a Gordo edge guard. Roy's recovery may not have height, but it's definitely got but it's definitely got the mix up. Oh, the PK freeze does it do it? Oh, they saucing him. Oh. Oh, the combo. Will that do it? He doesn't help, and I think that's it. That takes the game, and Cam and Chris take winners round one. Good stuff to them. Very close sets. Well done, gentlemen. Well done.